All right, you guys, this is Kim Mike before here again. Pretty much going to do something different again here. We're going to do a tutorial how to install a USB boot drive Windows 7 to a thumb drive. Uh, I found a website called intowindows.com. How uh, to do this? You want to remember, yeah, you have, to have two things a thumb drive that's minimum four gigs and your boot disk drive. So, pretty much, it tells you what to do right here. Let me turn that off. It's so annoying. Oh, sorry about that. So pretty much, we got to do is you see here on step number two, type in CMD and run as administrator, just to make sure. Okay, because you know you have to type in this D this port or this part. Enter. And this is gonna prompt itself for what to do. So you're gonna see how you see the description of the picture right down number three. I'm gonna say this part. Now it says this part. Now you type in list disk. Okay, I know for the fact of it that um, my disk, because I have like five different things on here, the thumb drive is on the bottom, it's obvious. So you type in, select disk, remember you have to do this right, if you mess up you have to start over completely. Disk, select disk 4, because of my, my USB thumb drive is the smallest one. Um, the entry has been selected, now it's been selected. Clean. It's been clean. Some of these things are too long to type, I would just uh, copy and paste it. It's create partition, uh, partition permit. Uh, then select, select partition. has been selected, activate. Activate. This is the part, it's the tricky part right here. It's gonna take a little bit to reformat it. Just to make sure it was good. And you gotta reformat it and what well, about halfway go here a little bit right now. I'm gonna pause it for a second, I'll be right back. All right, you guys, I'm back again. It's at 100% already. It's back to this part. And let's finish this up. So pretty much, to make sure that it's done, you're going to see your drive is going to be reformatted, removal with this it means it's been reformatted. Assign your, your drive. Assign. Assign. Now it's been assigned now. What was it done? I'm gonna save that. I just minimize it. And I wonder J. And exit. Well, it's obvious it's already not J anyway. Already. Okay, you're completely out of it. This is the next trick, tricky part here. Very simple. Read the steps for what to do. I just follow what I need to do. Um, it took me a little bit of use to this. But it's pretty much you have to boot from CD boot. As I enter that in. Enter. DVD CD boot. I enter that. CD boot. Boot from CD. Okay, this is the very tri the tricky part. See this whole word right here? So you have to type this in. Exactly, so that's better at copy boots. You remember it said here J instead of H because this guy had his drug on H. You have to uh, go back and put J. 
Then hit enter. It's gonna do this thing. It's gonna boot from the drive. It's gonna say this boot. Then completely done. Didn't say that. You see that? Okay. So pretty much it's done already. I said right here what to do. And pretty much you're done. That's all you gotta do. And the last step is after you're done with that, you have to move all your um Copy all your windows slash vista whatever you you have to move your drive and just have it ready to go and just, and just go in your BIOS move it to USB from HD or CD drive and a little be boot up and ready to go. So like I'm gonna just do real quick here, open and then you can see your error. Let's pop and paste real quick. And that should be it, and it's pretty much done. And uh, go in your files and re really switch the USB instead of uh, CD or uh, the hard drive, and you gotta boot up the disk. Alright, you guys, if you like it before here again, please subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and see you guys later.